Lucy, I'm home. Come, give me a welcome back hug. I know you're still shy, but come on. I think I deserve a hug after my long day at work, considering I make all this money for you. Where are you, puppy? Not under the bed. Not in the cabinets. Not in the bathroom, you little. You picked the damn lock, didn't you? I'll find you, puppy. Don't worry your pretty little head. Oh, there you are. Uh-uh, stop struggling. Did you really think you could escape from me? Just because I lock you in your nice little studio doesn't mean that is the only layer of defense I have to keep you here. The house is quite large and we're in the middle of nowhere. Even if you manage to get outside, you'd never be able to find anyone to help you. Now come on, let's get you back to your studio. I am very disappointed in you. I have been kind and gentle. I haven't even forced a kiss on you. I gave you this nice studio with everything you could ever need or want, and I make your favorite meals. But you're so ungrateful. With all your struggling, your refusal to eat, you barely even talk to me aside from your screaming. I have been extremely generous this entire time, puppy. Oh, you think I'm crazy because I kidnapped you. I took you away and spoiled you. You were working in that dead-end job as a fast food worker, barely making enough money to buy ramen. You were miserable, but you call this place hell? I think it's time I punish you for your behavior and show you who is in control here. You will regret being so bad, and you'll be begging for my mercy. <clears throat> to start, I'm chaining you to the bed. I wanted you to have some freedom to move around, but apparently that's too much for you. Alright, there. Now let's start with something simple. Let me roll you over onto your stomach and... Huh? That wasn't the scream I was expecting. Did I not do it hard enough? Oh, oh, I think I get it. My little puppy is on the naughty side. You can try to deny it, but those noises you made prove otherwise. Maybe you've been bad this entire time on purpose. Were you wanting me to punish you, my naughty puppy? Well, while this was supposed to be a punishment, I suppose I can keep playing along, since this is the first positive response I've had from you since I rescued you. Oh, your squeaks are adorable, and I can see your cheeks flushing. Are you embarrassed, puppy? 
definitely you can try to fight it, but we both know you're enjoying this. Such a naughty puppy. Perhaps you need a collar to remind you who you belong to. Would you like that? Come on. You need to speak up. That's a good puppy. Well, I think that's enough of that. Oh, don't look so upset. I promise I have more punishments in store for you. Alright, roll onto your back again. Good puppy. Now, since you haven't eaten in a long time, I think we should get some food for you. Wait right there, and I'll be back soon. I was considering letting you eat out of the bowl like the puppy you are, but since your wrists and ankles are chained to the bed, and the most movement you can manage is rolling around, I'll have to feed you personally. Open up, puppy. It's just honey and oatmeal. Something easy on your stomach. Oh no, you're still going to fight me. Naughty puppy. I'm not gonna let you get away with it this time. Open up. There you go. Look it off my fingers like a good puppy. I could have forced a spoon into your mouth, but this is more fun, don't you agree? Oh, don't talk with your mouth full. Here, have some more. Oh, and I wouldn't recommend trying to throw this up later. Unless you want to clean up your own mess. I won't let you waste food anymore. So even if you have to lick it up again, you will keep this oatmeal in your body. <laughs> you know, I'm actually having fun. It's liberating to not have to treat you like a glass figurine that'll break if I so much as raise my voice. And the look in your eyes. I adore it. Glistening with tears, but your face is flushed. Your heart is pounding in your chest, but not from fear. No, because my naughty puppy is enjoying himself. Just look at how good you're being. Finally eating. Despite the fight you put up at first, now you seem to be enjoying yourself. If only I knew this was what you were into at first. Then maybe you wouldn't have been so stubborn. Don't worry. I can punish you as much as you want from now on. There. Very good. You finished it all. Here, let me wipe your mouth. Bit messy. <sighs> I think you should get some sleep for now. This is the first meal you've had in days, and I can see how exhausted you are. I'll be back later with some new toys for my naughty puppy. Would you like that? I thought so. I'm glad you're finally starting to cooperate. I promise. I can make your life one full of all the pleasures you could only dream of before. 